Oh, we got going on the way. What the? What, what the heck is? <laughs> wow. Anyway, sorry about that. Yo, what we got going I'm, on today? I'm about to go train. Go get in there with my homegirl girl Sid. She's a beast. Y'all see me training with women often because they be going harder than dudes. Hey. It goes hard. Especially Sid. How you feeling today? I'm feeling good. You pushed me. I'm not gonna lie. You did push me today. Mm -hmm. I went but heavier than I usually go. I seen what you can do. Okay. I was gauging each set. Like, for right. sure. For sure. And we tweaked a little bit because you would typically do more reps going up. Yeah. I'm going two eight, 75. You're like, I would do five here. Mm -hmm. Now you do two. And I was like, only two? Okay. You had right. it, but you had the idea already. Right, you knew right. what you were doing. It's a certain discipline you have, have to have when you're trying to go heavy. Um, I used to be one of those people that, like, every set, I'm um, max reps. Max reps. And when I stopped doing that, my weight, my strength went up. Yeah, I felt super energized. Like, I didn't feel fatigued by the time I got mm. to 325. I was chilling. I was like, all right. Right, right. I'm doing it. So y'all check it out. So the press progression was a typical Mike Rasheed progression. Uh -huh. Very conservative reps going up mm -hmm. with lightweight increasing each time. Um, check it out right here. This is from set one to three. So here we go. She knocked out 275, easy peasy. Easy. Easy peasy. <laughs> and she was saying, what did you say before we worked out? How much, how, how heavy you wanted to go? I wanted 305. I said 305, somewhere in those 300s. I wanted it today. I felt mm -hmm. good. I was like, you got 315 easy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because here's the thing. That's 10 pounds. It Just is. Just say fuck it. Like, I, I don't believe in these <laughs> little, like, I make my jumps big. Yeah. And I just make sure I like, I never use safety racks. Uh, it's very rare that I have a spotter. Okay. I like that sense of urgency, you know what I'm saying? Because it's do or die at that point. There is a certain <laughs> level of brain power and willpower yeah. that goes into heavy lifts. And sometimes when you have all of the securities, you don't activate it. True. You know what I mean? So you have the option to fail. Like, can, okay, yeah, he's can, there, learn, right. the safeties are there. Correct. If I don't get it, I don't get Correct. it. Correct. So when you don't have all of that shit, like how I am, I'm like, I have to do it. Yep. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Out of all the years of my life, I failed maybe three squats straight up, right. you know? Okay. So, um, and there's one squat I, you know, a no, I had a nosebleed squat, like I was not gonna give up, you okay. know what I'm saying? So, you know, it, it happens sometimes, but when you just lock in your mind, like I got, I'm doing this, it's doing a wrap. It regardless. So, yeah. So we said forget 305. We did say forget 305. And not only did you do 315, you did it for, wait a minute, let's not tell them. Let's not. Y'all check it check out. Check it right. out. <laughs> for two. <laughs> it and moved way better than I expected. You, you have more. You could have did more, but we don't have to be greedy. You know what I'm saying? Conservative. Exactly. Conservative. Uh, 
not the political shit, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> but anyway, um, she did it again. Next set, we stayed right there. We No, we went up, right? We went up. Okay. We said, fuck it. Let's I was go standing up. there like, okay, do I go? He told me to do one more at this set. Mm -hmm. And I was like, mm. I was standing there. I would have been satisfied with 315 again, but I'm even more satisfied with, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> thank 325. You, thank you. So, yeah, so she did it. Check it out. For me, after 405, you know, I haven't squatted in like at least a month. Um, I kind of tweaked my right knee the last time I squatted heavy. You know, I got it, but someone was like, yo, I'm not happy with you right now. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> Your body I, was for sure talking to Right, you. right. So I tend to take, whenever I feel something tweak, whatever that lift is, I take off the next week. Um, but this time it took longer for me to feel better. And it's still not 100%, but... That's why I went from, I didn't go right from 405 to 495. Uh, I went in between with a quarter, so check it out right here. All right, so that moved pretty easy. It was light. And easy work. We said, fuck it, let's go up again. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm kind of built like that. So it's interesting though, like as much, like I could be in pain, but when I'm squatting, I don't feel that pain. You're locked in, like Well, it's focused. like, if you do a squat properly, you're in perfect position, like you your are. knees are safe. So it's very interesting. Um, if I haphazardly do a body weight squat, I feel it. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Like my body weight squats, even if I'm like, you know, just warming up, getting right. in the zone, I'm like, I feel a couple Real, little something, extra yeah. things. But when you got that heavy weight on, you're, you mentally you're locked into doing it perfectly because it's mm -hmm. dangerous. So I don't feel the pain. However, I don't feel, I don't feel very strong today. So, but like when you touch it on heavy weight, you got to always do it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because that shit will leave me. It ain't loyal. So I think the fact that I haven't been doing squatting uh, at least a month yeah. or so, I didn't feel very strong enough on the last set uh, on 495. But, really? but now so. the next time I do it, it'll, it'll be a lot oh, yeah. easier. It's going to be explosive. And we'll go up point. from there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, all right. Then after that, went up to 495, knocked that on out. Handled it. And then Sid <laughs> came down. We did one working, she did one working set for 285. Mm -hmm. Let's check that out. From there, I had to oh introduce her. Oh my goodness! To some cardio. We did some cardio. We did some. Uh, it's called a fatality set. Y'all already know what it is. And for y'all that want to try it, remember you don't lock out at the top because that's a little bit of a break. Mm -hmm. So you don't lock all the way out. I, I would cue whoever I'm training with at the hips where to go back down at. That way you're keeping that tension on the, on the quads and you're not giving yourself a break. And it kind of benefits you too because. When you're doing a bunch of reps and you start thinking about it, mm -hmm. it's impossible. But if you just keep going, going and going and before going. your brain catches up to what you're doing, chances are you get it. I didn't so. even know what number I was on at a certain point, but it burned. It was definitely a different tempo for yeah, me, but it yeah, was sure. a good tempo. And, and that helps with explosiveness too. For sure. You know, so y'all check out her fatality set. Fatality. Let's <laughs> handle it. Show them how it's done. Okay, so all the way down. Right there. Fast. Four, five, uh, six, good tempo. Seven, eight, nine, ten, come on. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, crank it out. 
16, you're almost there. Yep. 16, come on. 17, 18, two more. 19, uno mas. Easy fucking money, baby. Alright, so my fatality set wasn't much of a fatality. It was more of a like a coma set. <laughs> Not I a didn't, coma. Didn't quite set. die. It was, it was a coma. So, but once again, I'm trying to be I it was no pain or nothing. Yeah. But I'm trying to be mindful of Play my smart. need, make sure yeah, right. I'd rather have more for next time than mm -hmm. for today to be the last time. You know what I'm saying? So no. well, I have to take a break. But anyway, check it out. I knocked out a few. At 100%. what we do next leg extensions he lost his mind on these leg extensions completely lost it. you're wrong no you lost you're wrong it. i don't have a mind <laughs> i don't have a mind to lose so, so. it's already gone yeah <laughs> well here's the thing all right so we just did leg extensions after that so my thing is this i'd rather it, it's a term like being faithful with the little before getting a lot so mm -hmm. i don't feel like I always have to do a bunch of exercises to yeah. get the desired effect. Quality, it's all about, um, it's the about quality. quality. So if I'm doing some basic movement, I think the basics are the best. For sure. I'm gonna do it well. I'm not gonna just do that for three sets of ten. Right? Yeah, no. So we not did, gonna get much growth out of that. First of all, we isolated, we did isolateral movements, which is just the best case scenario. I tend to do that for every leg move, movement outside of squats. And we did fairly fairly high reps. 15 for the first set, mm -hmm. 20 for the second set, and that's per leg. And then the third set, we did 25, 25. Now keep in mind, each set, we're going up in weight. Yes. <laughs> so this is what you want to do. This is how you really kill it. This is how you, you're efficient. You don't always need an hour, hour and a half. You you know. could, if you know what you're doing, you can come in and get it in in 30 minutes and really murder it. So we did uh, 25, 25. Mm -hmm. Then right, stay right there, 10 and 10, and then ran a stack for as many reps as you can Ooh. at the end with both feet. So that was fun. You know what I'm saying? It, it was definitely a, I, de I got a pump. You know I saying? for sure got a pump. I was like, so many lifting faces. It was insane. That's what's up. Well, I really enjoyed this workout. It was fun. I enjoyed it. Can we do it again? Yes, definitely. Squat. squat. Yes. Y'all check Sid out. She's dope. All her info is down below in the, in the, with the, f all her info is down below in the, now I was about to say comment. <laughs> Description. Take three. Info down below in yeah, the yeah. description box. All her info. Check her out. Follow her on the gram. I'm going to get her on YouTube soon. You got a YouTube channel? I don't yet. You sure can. I well, know. actually, do y'all, should she have a YouTube channel? Let me know. Should let I get a YouTube channel? Comments below, and we'll holler at y'all next time. Peace.